Welcome to the wonderful world of Golden Book Video, where books come to life. We've got the coolest tales in town. Nursery Raps with Mama Goose, featuring the voice of Natalie Cole, brings these timeless fairy tale favorites rocking into the 90s. A wrap along, dance along, laugh along treat for younger viewers. Hello there, kids. What's your name? Are you ready to play a little rap and rhyme game? My name is Mama, Mama Goose, and I've got some nursery raps for you. I've been rapping with kids for a long, long time. Even your parents know my rhyme, so pay attention. We're on our way. Come have some fun with Mama Goose today. Little Miss Muppet was sitting on a top, and she was eating her curds and whey. Me again. Now along came a spider, that's a me, I sat beside her, and I scared a Miss Muppet away. <laughs> so I'm on my way, I wish I could stay, but I got a way too much to do. I got kids that scare, I mean, they're everywhere. Hey, kids, don't worry, though, I won't scare you. This is serious. And from Precious Moments, a brand new eagerly awaited volume starring the voice of Pat Boone and theme song performed by James Ingram and Melissa Manchester. Simon the Lamb is the beautifully animated story of an odd-looking little lamb who proves it's not what's on the outside, but what's inside that counts. This Christmas, ask for other Golden Book video and music titles from Precious Moments to complete your collection. And from the award-winning John Matthews collection, come two brand new stop-motion adventures, full of sing-along songs, hilarious mishaps, and fairy tale fun. Three Little Pigs Sing a Gig and Goldilocks and the Three Bears Sing Their Little Bitty Hearts Out offer contemporary interpretations of these traditional tales to tangle your tongue and tickle your toenails. can't help singing loud and strong and don't forget the rest of John Matthews' amazing collection of stop-motion magic already available on video cassette. Uncle Elephant, Mouse Soup, The Adventures of Curious George, Frog and Toad Are Friends, and Frog and Toad Together, and Stanley and the Dinosaurs. It's all a part of the wonderful world of Golden Book Video, where books come to life. Look out, world, cause here we come. for more blue. Oh, uh, yes. Send it up. Ugh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, 
That's right, just a bit more, Roly, then we'll be home. <laughs> Say, little fella, what are you doing out here all alone? <laughs> well, little fella, I've got a nice warm barn for you to live in. Why don't you come along with us? We'll get you something to eat. Let you make a lot of new friends. Yeah. Oh, you'll enjoy that. Let's go home, Roly. Get this little fella settled in. <laughs> Hello, Shep. Did you look after everyone while I was gone? I found this little fella all alone near the meadow. Let's find him a nice, warm place to spend the night. Sleep tight, little fella. <sighs> we'll introduce you around in the morning. have already had their babies. I saw the shepherd bringing him last night. It must be a foundling. A foundling? Who is it? Wonder where he came from. What's he like? Gather round, everybody. I have a surprise for you. We have a new addition to our flock. So, let's make him welcome. All right. <gasps> Have you ever seen What's him? What's wrong with him? I don't know. He's blue. He is blue. Look at that. I've never seen anything like oh. that. Well, aren't you handsome? This little lamb is part of our family now. We must all do our very best to make him feel at home with us. Why are you blue? I... I don't know. I didn't used to be. Albert, it's not like he wants to be blue. Do you? I don't think so. Well, it doesn't make any difference. Come on, you can play with us. Do we have to play with him? Now yeah, he's so different. Not like us at all. I'm glad I don't have to wear blue wool. No wonder he's all alone in the world. Look what I did. It's not all your fault, Timmy. We all should have been more careful. But I was the one who spilled the paint. Now what are we going to do about it? Maybe we should wait a bit and see what happens. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it'll work out. Poor little guy. Hello. Ah! Don't ever do that. Sorry. What are you doing? Oh, what am I doing? Uh, uh, I'm playing a game. Can I play too? Uh-uh, go play with your friends. Don't have any friends. Aw, oh, poor kid. One second, bud. Okay, you can play. That's great. Uh, what are we playing? Boy, uh, Simon Says, of course. Simon says, wiggle your tail. Great. 
Simon says, uh, wiggle your ears. Good. Simon says, jump on this lever. Yes! Way to go, kid! Mwah! I like this game. What now? Uh, I'm gonna make some room in the barn by moving this cheese right off. Wait, let's be reasonable. Oh, you, you're jumping to the wrong conclusion. Hey, she's my friend. Thanks, kid. Don't worry about me. Gotta run. School time. Children, time for school. Again. My name's Daisy, by the way. What's your name? I'm, well, I'm Simon, I guess. Nice to meet you. Simon, I guess. <laughs> hey, are you coming to school? School? Mm-hmm. Hurry up or we'll be late for class. School? Class? That's very good, class. And I know you remember from our lesson yesterday just why Shepherd's Lantern is blue. Yes, Gretchen. Um, there are many dangers in the world, but keeping the blue lantern in sight will help keep you safe. All right. Let's review some of the creatures you may encounter so you'll know just what to do. Class, you know how we play friend or foe? Friend. Bad. Very good. Let's try another one. Friend. That's right. Now let's give our newest young student a chance. Yes, you, young fellow. Please tell the class, friend or foe. Oh, that one is my friend. Huh? <laughs> hey, is his brain blue too? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is terrible. We've got to do something. That little lamb is having a terrible time because he's blue and it's all my fault. You just made a little mistake, Timmy. But he's the one who's getting the worst end of it. Fall is ending. The winter storms will hit soon, little ones. Enjoy the high pasture while you can. Oh, boy! Let's oh, go! Last one there, sour milk! <laughs> Somebody else. That wasn't very nice. It wasn't his fault that you tripped and fell on top of him. Hi again. <laughs> Can I play? Didn't I tell you don't ever do that? Yes, I'm sorry. I just wanted to say hello. Whoa, uh, hello. Uh, uh, now, if you'll excuse me, I'm busy. Doing what? Look, I can't play right now. Okay, I understand. Whoa, Simon. Look, kid, wise up. We can't be friends. We can never be friends. Why not? Look at us, can't you tell? You don't like me because I'm blue? Aw, oh, for the love of... Look at me, I'm a fox. Do you get it? F-O-X. <laughs> 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 <laughs
X Fox. So, why does that matter? Hiding. I am hiding. They are your friends. No, they're not. You're my only friend. They all make fun of me because I'm different. No matter what I do, they don't like me. Simon, where are you? See, they do like you. No, they don't. Albert doesn't for sure. Maybe if I was big and strong like him. Look, kid, you'll never be an Albert but you can be the very best Simon in the world. Now, go prove it. There he is! Simon! Come over here! There's another lamb that's just like you! Just like me? Yes, and he wants to talk to you. He's on that far hill way over there. Call to him. Oh, hello? Hey, he heard me. Who is he? Do you know his name? No, I don't. You ask him. <laughs> What's your name? What's your name? Hey, I asked you first. I asked you first. No, you didn't. I did. No, <laughs> you didn't. <laughs> <Ow, Bert. laughs> What's wrong, Simon? I was talking to this other lamb across the valley, and we got in an argument. And what did you say to him? Nothing. Nothing? Well, maybe I did say something first. Um, why don't you go back and apologize? I'm sure the two of you can be friends. Friends. Let's be friends. Okay. What's your name? Mine is Simon. Mine is Simon. Your name is Simon, too? Your name is Simon, too? Can't you say anything different? Can't you say anything different? <sighs> He's not real, is he? Uh, not exactly. That's just an echo of your voice. But you're real. Oh. So I made friends with a voice? Maybe you made friends with yourself. <laughs> What's the big secret, Albert? You're not gonna play another trick on Simon, are you? Me? No. We just want to include him in a little fun. Shh, here he comes. <laughs> Simon, we were just looking for you. You were? Me? Sure. We're all gonna play Blind Lamb's Bluff. Wanna join? Would I? Sure. What do I have to do? All you have to do is find us. Blindfold him. Well, okay. First we spin you around a few times, and when we stop, you have to tap one of us. Hold still. Let me catch you. <laughs> Where are you guys? Albert, don't let him wander into... I can't hear you guys. Am I getting closer? Oh, looks like there's a storm brewing. Let's get these lambs back to the farm before the storm hits. <gasps> the shepherd's lantern. We've got to go. Yeah. Let's go! Albert? Daisy? You've got to make a little noise at least. Wait a minute. Where's Simon? Isn't he with you? No! I thought he was with you! Don't worry. He'll be along any minute. He's just shy. <laughs>
97, 98, 99. Shep, we're missing one. It's that, it's that new little fella. Come on, Shep, let's go find him. Did you hear that? Simon is lost somewhere out there. Oh, no. We forgot all about him. Maybe I should go out and look for him. We'll come, too. Yeah, yeah let's go. We're coming. Come on. We gotta help our friends. Country. We've got to be careful. Maybe I should just stay in the woods with you. No, they're probably worried sick about you back at the barn. I don't think so. Oh, I don't know. I think maybe they care more about you than you know. I don't think this is the right way. Maybe we should call for... What? Yelling! I thought I heard a cry for help. It came from somewhere up there. Ken, wait! You can't go out there. It's too dangerous. It's the only way I can see. It could be my friends. And I should do something if I can. Hello? Hello? Where are you? Where are you? Come on, kid. Maybe it was just the wind. Just one more try. Hello? Come down, that rock isn't safe. They can't hear me over the wind. I guess there's nothing I can do. Simon, well, what is that? I, I don't know, but, but it sure is bright. I wonder what it could mean. Help! This isn't working. No one will ever hear us. I wish the shepherd was here. Maybe we should try one more time. Have... Wait, what's that? Hey, it's the shepherd's lantern. We're saved. We can make it if we hurry. Oh, the lunch. If it hadn't been for the shepherd's lantern, we'd be buried in the bottom of the ravine. Saved us. I can't hear them anymore, Oscar. Simon, come down from there. I just wish I could have done something to help out. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, Simon. <laughs> Where's the shepherd? The shepherd isn't here. It was Simon who was calling for you. This light was shining down on him, but the rock crashed over the edge and, and took him with it. You mean Simon did that for us? Gee, I... 
I guess so. That was a wonderful thing to do, Simon. Thank you. There you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. But what are the rest of you doing out here? Well, thank goodness you're safe. Come on, let's all get to the bar. We came to save Simon, but he saved us instead. Strange that there was a light in the middle of a snowstorm? I wonder where it came from. Oh, that was pretty scary, Timotheus. But it turned out all right, didn't it? So letting the starlight shine on Simon was an inspired idea. Thank you. Well, we got another rainbow to paint. Let's get started. Oh, boy, can I be orange this time? Uh, well, you've done such a splendid job here, Timmy. Why don't you stay and make sure they get home all right? Oh, he'll be fine now. He's got friends who will... Hey, wait, you guys. Oh, come on. Can I at least watch? I'll be real quiet. Come on, you guys. I just want to help. 